Hey, Matt here from Fossman, and I'm going to show you how to set up your Bluetooth gaming controller. The Fossman Bluetooth gaming controller is compatible with Nintendo Switch, Android, iOS, and PC. I'll show you how to connect your controller to each of these platforms. Pairing to a Nintendo Switch. First of all, power on the Switch. Find the controller setting on your Nintendo Switch. Navigate to the change grip slash order, and then select it. Press the Y and Home buttons on the gaming controller to put it into pairing mode. You should see the four LEDs blink and turn. It should take five to seven seconds for the gaming controller to properly pair to your Switch. Follow the Switch's prompts and it should pair. If your controller was once paired to a Nintendo Switch, all you have to do is press the Home button and it will reconnect. You will need to redo the pairing process if you update the console, turn off or rest the console, or change to another console. The controller will automatically enter in sleeping mode if idle more than five minutes. To reconnect, press the home button. Pairing to an Android device with Bluetooth as an Android game controller. Press the X plus home buttons at the same time. LED1 and LED4 will blink, indicating it is in pairing mode. Navigate to settings, Bluetooth, on your Android device and open up the Bluetooth settings. Scan for new Bluetooth devices and find the device STK 7039 RG. Click on it to pair. Once paired, LED1 and LED4 will stay lit, indicating that it is paired as an Android game controller. Pairing to an Android or iOS 13.0 Plus device or PC with Bluetooth as an Xbox wireless controller. Press A plus home buttons at the same time. LED1, LED2, and LED3 will blink, indicating that it is in pairing mode. Go to Settings, Bluetooth on your device and open Bluetooth settings. Scan for new Bluetooth devices and find the device called Xbox Wireless Controller. Click on it to pair. Once paired, LED1, LED2, and LED3 will stay lit, indicating that it is paired as an Xbox Wireless Controller. PC Wired Controller Mode You can connect the controller to a PC with the provided USB Type-C cable. LED1, LED2, and LED3 will stay lit, indicating that it is connected. RGB Lighting Control Press the RGB Control button to cycle through RGB modes. There are three modes for the RGB lighting. First press, RGB Breathing. Different colors will cycle through. Second press, RGB Lighting will stop on current color. Third press will turn off RGB lights. Turbo slash Auto Mode to enable turbo slash auto speed functions, press the turbo button plus A, B, X, or Y to enable. Press turbo plus A, B, X, or Y again to enable auto. Repeat these steps to disable. To adjust the speed, press turbo simultaneously with the up or down arrows. Pressing up makes turbo faster. Pressing down makes it slower. Clearing turbo slash auto function. Press and hold down the turbo button for five seconds. You should see the four LED lights light up together and the controller will vibrate for about a second. All turbo functions should be cleared out. Controller Vibration Adjustment There are four levels of vibrations in our gaming controller. High, medium, low, and no vibration. Make sure the controller is properly paired. Press L1, L2, R1, and R2 simultaneously and hold down for five seconds. When you feel the controller vibrate, you can release the buttons. By repeating these steps, intensity can be adjusted. The LEDs will light up corresponding to the current level of vibration intensity. Congrats, your Fossman Bluetooth gaming controller is all set up.